You hear that? It's watch game time. All right guys, welcome to the adult man. My name is William and today I just got a shipment of the Watch Gang Black subscription, and so I am going to sit down, I am going to open this box up, and we are going to take a sneak peek, a first look at what's inside that box. I haven't checked it out yet, but I'm about to, and you're coming along for the ride. Let's dive in. All right guys, so this is the Watch Gang, again, the Watch Gang Black membership. And I am going to tear into this right now and open it up and see what's inside. We'll check it out together. So, handy dandy knife. Okay. Grails for good. So, if you make a donation, you claim your entry to win a grail. That's like a Rolex or an Omega. Those super nice watches. Here is what I got. Here's my watch right here. This is an Earnshaw. Earnshaw. Not familiar with the brand, but it says 1805, so it's been around for a long time. I'll go and scroll through some of their website in a little bit so we can kind of get a better idea of everything they offer. But I'm just gonna do like first impressions right here. All right, so it comes in a cardboard box like that. Then it comes in a wooden box. The first thing I am noticing is that there's some, there's some stuff hanging out of it. So it looks a little bit sloppy, but the, the, the wooden box is really nice. Uh, it's a huge wooden box, so I'm not gonna be traveling with it, but still, it's nice. And inside, yeah, so the, um, Packaging's a little weird. It comes with that blue alligator print strap. I'm sure this is not alligator. I'm sure this is just regular uh, cowhide leather, but it's blue alligator strap. I have like a million of those now. Uh, there's a bunch of trash, it looks like, on the inside. So that's, that's that, but damn. Look at that. All right, here it is. Oh, an automatic watch. All right, so taking a look at this uh, right off the bat, it looks like there are two sub dials in it. Or no, actually, no, it's just one 24 hour sub dial and a window into the automatic movement where you can kind of see the, where you can see the gems in there or the jewels. Uh, I would say it's about a 42 millimeter case. That's my guess. It looks about 42 millimeters, maybe 43. Stainless steel, uh, quite tall. So maybe 12 to 14 millimeters in height. I don't have the exact uh, specifics, but I'm gonna I'm gonna go on do a little search and get those specifics. I'm gonna I'll post them right over here, have them flash on the screen for the exact measurements. But a couple things that I like right away. I love the crown. This bulbous crown is really interesting, really cool. Gives it kind of like an older look to it or older style, uh, but really elegant too. I love in the background of this dial. We have a really interesting pattern which plays very nicely off the light, and so I'll get a close-up in there. Kind of look at that. It uses Roman numerals and Arabic numerals uh, for very like stylistic, it skips, what, nine, 10, um, and four. So it skips a, couple, skips a couple numbers in there, but I think that just looks really, really cool. And of course, it's got a nice mesh band. I honestly don't think I'm going to use this blue alligator strap. I do not like alligator straps, and I especially do not like blue alligator straps, but that's my personal preference. If you, I, I like that it comes with a second strap. I think that's super cool. Again, remember, um, Watch Gang comes in, this is a, this watch showed up due to a $100 membership. So the black tier is $100, and this watch, just seeing that it's an automatic and feeling it, kind of the heft, the size, a lot of just the, the, the uniqueness to this watch, that is definitely worth it. That's a great deal. Um, really happy with that. That's awesome. It looks like there's even a dome to this crystal. Um, my guess is that it's sapphire or sapphire coated. It kind of has that purpley sheen to it. So I'm also gonna check that out. And again, uh, yeah, automatic movement, Super cool looking dial, really refined, elegant crown, mesh band, nice crystal, um, all for $100. That, that is a great deal. So I'm really happy with this. Um, again, don't know about the blue alligator straps. 
Here are all the actual specifics of this watch. Um, I'm gonna look it up and I'm gonna post those right there. So in terms of case size, material, um, all those things, I'm gonna post that right here. But yeah, first impressions right away. Really cool watch. Very excited to have this as part of my collection. Right now I am seeing a few, uh, Joma Shop is selling Earnshaw watches for about 155. Let's take a look at their actual website. All right guys, so I am looking through the Earnshaw website right now and I am seeing that their, their automatics, the cheapest automatic that you can get on the Earnshaw website, uh, the Swiss made automatic is like 910 pounds. So over a thousand dollars. And remember, uh, watch gang black tier is $99 uh, for this for this watch. So just $99. That's really cool. All right, guys, let's talk about what I like and what I don't like about watch gang. Uh, first of all, what I like, again, love the fact that I got this beautiful watch. Uh, very, very hefty, very sturdy, sapphire crystal, Swiss made, automatic, really interesting dial mesh band, there's a little dome to this crystal too that it makes it a little more elegant and cool. Um, and this kind of dual, this little window from the front where you can see through the dial and you can see into the watch movement, that's super cool. So overall, like the style a lot. Number two, the price is fantastic, $99. Again, this watch is definitely, I would value this definitely over $100. And whether we want to go with Joma Shop and say it's 150, or if we want to go with the Earnshaw website and say it's like over $1,000, either way, you're, in my opinion, you're certainly getting your money's worth with this Earnshaw watch right here. All right, and here is what I don't like about watch gang or what I didn't like about this experience was just that it looked like somebody threw this watch into the case from like half court. Somebody just took a half court shot and boom, like it just landed where it did, boxed it up and sent it off. Um, that's not really a problem because, you know, I have a little more experience with watches. And so when I open it up and I take a look at this thing, I can feel it, I can look at it. And I'm like, wow, that, that is good. Quality. I could see it's a sapphire crystal. I could see that it's an automatic movement. The mesh band feels great. So right away, my first impressions, I can kind of overcome them with, with looking it up and seeing that. But if I were to get this as a gift, I would imagine that being problematic because you don't want somebody to get a gift and just have a bunch of paper falling out of it. So that's my only downside to watch gang. Um, of course, as a service, you don't know what you're getting. So you may not get this awesome Earnshaw watch. However, uh, with this being my personal first experience with watch gang, I've heard a lot of great things about them. We've reviewed them in the past and I'm really happy with this watch. So I will continue, especially with that $99 watch gang uh, black tier price. I think that's a great deal. It's a great way to build an, an impressive watch collection. I mean, whole year, 12 watches. That's a great watch collection right there. All right, guys, that's it for us today. Please tap that subscribe button down below. If you want to go read our full in-depth watch gang review, we've reviewed their black tier and their platinum tier on theadultman.com, which I will have links to both of those articles down in the description below. Let me know what you think about watch gang down in the comments below if you have subscribed to them in the past or if you're thinking about it, you can feel free to ask any questions and me or someone from the Adult Man fam community will reach out to you, we will talk to you and uh, answer any questions you have. So thank you again, guys. Until next time, stay manly.